Or... No, it's not. What is this stuff on here? We're hockey night in Canada and we're talking about saving the world and all that stuff. Let's talk hockey. Well, would yeah. you be a little leery of hiring him a second time? Yeah, well, the so thing... So he is in a, in a case... It wasn't prejudice. racism, though. It was well, because... it is. No, it isn't. It was, be uprise, it, it was between him and the GM. That's why he didn't get it. It wasn't racism at all. And no, uh, no. let's never get into that again. I've right. lost the whole thing. No. Uh, that left winger, uh, the oh. sky has fallen, Suzuki, he'd be happy he's with him. That was sickening last week, by the way. What? Uh, that's, what is that going junk. on with you? Fair shake in life. Go out and get your own fair shake in oh, life and work darn. for it. Don't that's... give me that stuff. And you women are going to get mad at me out there. When you come to the games, keep your eyes on the puck. And I'm telling you, I've seen some awful smacks. And it's always a woman yapping away there. No, Look at the game. Lots of fans. What are you talking? Both genders ah, get involved in talking about the game. I agree. I'm just, just trying to help look them. Look at the puck, but don't blame women, men, or anybody else for uh, getting in the odd well, conversation. Uh, lives here? I didn't know. I yeah, he lives in Boston in the summer. You know, he's rich now, eh? He's in, in, and everybody knows the reason what it is. It's Pavel Burry last year in the seventh game using blackmail, saying, I either get $6 million or I don't play the seventh game. Now, what kind of a guy is that? That's exactly what happened. He did play the seventh How game. How do you know it happened? It happened. Everybody, and it's all over. Everything happened. They signed the guy, Pat Quinn, good Irish guy, would never do that. The owner says sign him because they got a new building coming up and they need a superstar. <laughs> need a super. They're not selling out this year. I didn't see it. I've, it's been reported to me uh, that uh, comments were made about Pavel Burry. In fact, uh, very disparaging comments uh, by Don, and I know there's some prejudice in his game as part of the stick and all that sort of thing, but, but uh, he slandered this young man. This boy didn't threaten to walk out from this hockey team in the seventh game, the first game, or anything else last year. That's good. It's you know, it is. Well, we might as well just sit here, and then no. how much time we, we got, got left? we got a couple of minutes, for sure. Got a couple Two of minutes. A couple of minutes. And they get thrown together to the job. But listen, you kid, don't get caught in the Canadian syndrome where if it's Canadian, it's got to be bad. We're the best. I've been telling you the best. How about the guy that used to be on it about four or five years ago? And you know those other, the amazing upper body strength of the Russians. So amazing. Go. They're nothing. Just a minute. No, They're sorry. nothing. Turn in Calgary. T-H-I-N. Had a nothing. finish touch, but only one had a touching finish, and that was overseas, according to Don Cherry and the coaches. Canada. Carl Wilson, Hockey Night in Canada on CBC. That's Nathan, I think, raised a great point. Here's of course a... he doesn't like the the banging and the smash and why would he? he's only this high yeah but he can maybe relate to the eight-year-old that would love to play this game oh eight-year-old this is professional game. hockey we're talking about quit talking about eight-year-old and that why don't we show sid the kid no you want to show him show him then all sure. right go ahead instead of the benches on the same side but you were right that's what that was part yeah, of the problem sure, i guess so sid would be pleased to make oh i guess he would yeah best to get out of it. sure I got to show him because I show Cavalier and I show the rest of the guys, so I got to show him. It's good. Keep them all happy. Everybody happy. Oh, Don. Andrew, Fer <laughs> Andrew Ferentz. Yeah. And did nothing but praise Vancouver till it got sickening. I brought up all his trades. I brought up everything. All I've ever done, Ojek and all, is praise the Vancouver Canucks. I never, everybody ever come up to me and said, good job, Don. But let me say one thing wrong, and I'm going to get punched in the head. 